getting ready as I'm filming this as well, so you're gonna be seeing me, you know, go from a naked mole rat to a beautified naked mole rat. So just be patient. Everything's great. So starting on my clothing journey of what we're picking out for my interview, which is in like two hours. So, just like I said, I'm gonna show pictures of what the website currently looks like, of basically the mood board that I'm going off of, but it's very, it has like a beachy feel, also probably because they're releasing spring, but it has it's a mixture between kind of like a plain, almost like southern-ish boutique, it's not boho, but it's a little mixture of everything, I think. But I have to pick out something that is obviously from my own closet, but it's still inspired by what they have. So here are currently two options that I'm going with. Potentially three if I mix them together. Because it is spring, so I liked what they have that they consider their modern set. It's more, uh, it's not palazzo pants, but like the thin linen, they do a lot of that. Uh, they have a lot of the vests right now with um, like tailored lightweight pants as well, which I really like. I don't have any of those. Well, I had one pair and they shrunk, so we can't wear those. And they also are see-through. So option one, I have, this is still drying because I just washed it. But I have this really big H&M shirt that I got from Goodwill that is, uh, it goes down, it, I mean, it fits like a dress, it's like a t-shirt dress, but it has like a big billow in the back. So it gives like a little bit of cutesy shape. So option one is I can wear that. And then they have blazers as well. And so, and they also do a lot of neutral colors. I noticed that they actually really don't have black at all. So I nixed black from my outfit options, like wearing black leather, anything like that. They don't have any kind of leather. It's very like light, airy, like Alice Beach kind of vibes. So I could wear this together with, um, I haven't picked out the shoes yet, but probably a boot or something like that. They do, they have a lot of like chunky um, summer sandals right now. And then, option two was they have so these kind of material uh i forget what these are what kind of material this is i'm pretty sure it's, it's literally just cotton but it's that more like lightweight material and they have a lot of the stripes so i picked out these to go with this as option two so it'll have very much like the spring mixed feel but i thought the stripes gave it a little bit more of a modern look which would go more with what I want to wear. Then option three was this dress from H&M that I don't really wear a ton. It cinches in the middle. Uh, it's a very like elevated, a little bit of an elevated, almost like nighttime cocktail beach dress. Like I could, not cocktail, but I would wear this out um, to get drinks maybe at the beach at night or something. But I wanted to make it a little more professional and so I was going to add this brown blazer over it. Now, I don't know what this is gonna look like when I actually try it on, so I might completely disregard this. I'm definitely leaning towards the first two because this also is not really gonna give me a lot of shape, but I could always put a belt around it, something like that because also with this store, I would have different clients that come in and I need to know their style, know where they're going on vacation and be able to dress them according, which is what most stylists do. But this store is a little bit more of like a personal shopping vibe. So the goal that I'm gonna do even for myself is 
inspired looks from the store but seeing if we can wear them in different ways so i haven't i didn't see any models that are wearing like a sh a blazer over a dress i saw ones in a dress and in a blazer and then i didn't see any ones belted but combining them i'm able to elevate my own personal style potentially these women and even maybe their models that they use for the clothes and then just show off their clothes better which is just kind of how i dress like what can I do with pieces that I already have? Just wear them differently instead of necessarily going out and buying an entire outfit. You can always change up the way you're wearing a piece of clothing. So I will show you guys what I end up choosing. Okay, I tried on these pants. I've also been doing my abs, so I've been losing tummy fat which is why these pants finally look how they're supposed to again see um you can't really see them on the full video but this is how they look in the back let me see if i can get a more full view for you guys okay this is how they look in the bottom like this so they fit my legs really well which hello we love that and I chose them because they still have a very light, airy feel, perfect for spring, but the stripes just give it a little bit of style, personality, and a lot of their earrings are either chunky gold hoops or really big hoops, and because I'm wearing just a plain white sweater, I tend to go for bigger earrings that have a little bit more of a statement feel, where if I have a little busier top going on, then I'll put more simple earrings on so i would put like a bigger skinnier hoop now i would wear even bigger chunky gold hoops than this but i think i either lost them or i just don't have them anymore so my shirt's still drying you saw it behind me i'm probably going with this outfit just because i feel like it's a very the only words i know to use is like rich girl beach vibe which is basically the entire store because some of their shoes are like $365, but I'm gonna get 30% off if I get a job there, so prayers. <laughs> All right, to be determined uh, the whole outfit once my, or no, not to be determined, <sighs> to be viewed later once my shirt is dry. Okay, this is also the shoe that I'm working with right now because I'll be honest, this shoe style is not my favorite. I just don't think it looks the best on me and that is like the square toe and then not necessarily the square heel but unless it's like a true platform heel i don't really wear it. example they have a lot of these shoes on their website now i have these because you can wear them to weddings because of the heel it's so thick and i'm gonna wear them most likely because one they're ivory white and they go with the look of the shoe but i'm also just stating they're not my favorite type of shoe because the square heel or sorry not square heel square toe I just think it kind of looks weird on girls some people can pull it off but my favorite is either like an almond or I'll show you my wedding shoes I, will, I have my engagement shoot this weekend them in a little cute little baggy so they don't get dirty i feel like there should be like a halo around these and glowing this is my ideal shoe because of the way that it looks on the toe elongates like going down it will elongate your leg which makes your legs look thinner square toes can honestly tend to make your legs look thicker so if you are a teeny girl and you want your legs to look thicker maybe wear the square shoes but i don't really need any help in that area so i like to wear the skinny pointed toe shoes because they look better on me so anyway just a small little tidbit about the shoes How feel out there? i'm light years call me eons when the snare kick in the beat is neon lights yeah i'm feeling magnificent uh can't last what I'm up against. Yeah, you know I stay fresh like pepper mess, right? And I dive head. I had to let me fix that. Okay guys, 
I got the job. Anyway, um, yeah, so I got, well, they gave me an offer letter. We will see if I actually take it. Um, but I never actually showed you guys what I wore. I mean, I just showed it right then, but I ended up going with a all cotton vibe, but, um, the like light springy kind. Um, I really wanted to wear my slides, but I was a little cautious of if that would be a little too casual. So I wore my shoes that I showed you guys, the white ones with the heel. It really wasn't my favorite just because I don't like those shoes and I think that they look kind of worn, but I wore them anyway. And my interview went great. You're seeing me actually after coming back from the gym and I just realized that I forgot to show you guys what I wore. So this is what I wore. Um, but yeah, anyways, I got the job. So we'll see if I take it or not. But I have always been praying that fashion... I've always been praying that fashion will be my ministry. And I don't know. I'm wondering if this is going to be the thing that does it. Or at least the, like, building block to do it. Um, but I'm going to pray about it. And we're going to see. But hope you guys liked the video. Thanks for watching if you made it this far. And hope you like the outfit. But until next time.